Hey, it's Kami. How's your day today? And welcome to the corner. Uh, today is the last day of November, which means that I've had some uh, things planned for December. So I kind of wanted to go over it. In the past, if somebody had uh, joined or like subbed to me or joined my community, I really didn't have a name for the people who um, came to my community. And I've decided to call you guys butterflies because butterflies is one of the things that <clears throat> kind of allude to my daughter my daughter's the most important thing in my life so calling you guys butterflies um really goes along deep in my heart so butterflies it is and uh the kind of catchphrase it's going to be spread your wings because um life is tough and unless you get over the fear and spread your wings and fly you're going to be stuck doing the things that you really don't want to do. So I, if you go through your fears and accomplish what you want to accomplish, um, things are a lot better than if you are ruled by your fears. So if you will join me into the hub, the hug club, which is the name of the club of the people that uh, fall, uh, subscribe to me or join my Patreon, um, you will be considered a butterfly. I'm thinking of changing the emote on twitch to a butterfly so that's main community changes right there i have a general schedule i've been struggling for months now trying to figure out the best way to do um schedules i've been kind of like experimenting with things that's why i haven't been too consistent with what i've been doing because i've been trying to figure out how my schedule will allow me to do the things that I want to do and so basically what I what the answer was was that everything that I wanted to cram into one week I decided to spread out to two weeks so instead of having a video a day I'm having a video every other day basically and um and that's what it's gonna be and that allows me to do the other things that I've been doing so basically um the schedules will be released on saturday for the following week you can get them on discord you can get it on my twitter account and i'll talk about it in streams and stuff but starting tomorrow which is december 1st the uh, phase for um creative content for me is going to be the main thing in my life yes i'm still going to go to the post office and work and i'll still be doing uber and yes i still have family to take care of and stuff which are all very important but i'm going to focus more energy on content creation just to so I'm more consistent part of that is because even though I've been making content on the internet for 15 years now, it's like 2002, 2003 is when I first made my first website and uh, updated every day about things I was doing in my life. Um, since then, I've always kept it from my friends and family. It's always been for people online. Uh, my friends didn't really know about it. My family didn't really know about it. And I've been kind of, I um, went back to Facebook and I started sharing things with my family about what I've been doing online. And the response is overwhelmingly, yeah, forget everything else. Um, they're a little biased. I'll say that before I finish this. But they, my mom's like, yeah, you're a natural. So just, just do, do what you want to do because whatever you do, you're going to do well with it. You know how moms are. <laughs> so I'm gonna I'm gonna focus on it. So things that um, will happen is there'll be videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. The Monday video, which will be either Mr. Craft or my single player world, if you are a Patreon, will be released the weekend before it is released to you guys. So if you're a Patreon, you get my main Minecraft video, the video I work the hardest on each week. Um, a few days before you would online on YouTube so there's a little plus there um, plus I have been invited to write for survivor culture which is a website that is based on um, recovering from sexual abuse for those that don't know I went through sexual abuse growing up and it has really scarred me and in order for me to get over those scars writing out what is in my head and just getting it out on paper and sharing it with people one helps me 
two may help other people and three is just it's just good to get that information out there to help me recover from the problems i had so each week on survivor culture that's the name of the website i am a featured writer um writing about <clears throat> different aspects of emotions that i went through and how i've dealt with them and stuff like that so keep an eye out for those i'll promote those in discord and on on twitter also um the podcast is coming this week um i'm gonna try and do this podcast once a week but um i'm still trying to find the best time to record these um so the podcast is not cemented yet so it may be a week or so but i'm gonna try my best to get start starting on that right away and it will be on itunes spotify and all the places like that um i've been promoted enough with the uh, podcast even not doing it to um get a bunch of people who are looking forward to it to the point that they're gonna put it on itunes and stuff i guess we'll see um also i'm gonna be doing some music reviews um prog rock reviews because prog music pro progressive rock music is my favorite type of music and when i say progressive rock i mean the classic rock bands like yes rush king crimson Pink floyd and stuff and i enjoy music enough that i'm gonna just start doing reviews i don't know if i'm gonna do it in a podcast way or if i'm gonna just write them out i haven't decided that yet i kind of want to write them out because that's what i used to do way back in the day um, because I'm a, really a musicologist and also streaming is going to be on Tuesdays and Thursdays now I'm going to start now in December now that um, the experiment schedule stuff is done with I'm going to make sure not to miss any of those streams so I guarantee you unless I give you a week's notice in advance that I will be streaming at two I mean on Tuesday and Thursdays at uh, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and not that I don't want to do a third day just yet but I have so many extra streams scheduled through mr craft and working with other people in the next few weeks that i will be streaming three days a week for a while so keep your eyes open for some unscheduled streams some fun stuff is going to be going on we're doing a lot of fun stuff with other people and um so everything's kind of coming together um my health has get, gotten a lot better so i'm starting to feel better so i'm starting to get the motivation back that i had lost with the hurricane last year since since hurricane Irma, i've been on a streak of yuck and i feel like i'm getting off that streak of yuck finally and i can start doing what i want to do so that's everything that's going on um just keep an eye out for the schedules on saturday and um hopefully um you guys will like the materials that i release and i one last thing i did finish with uh jack conti the owner of patreon and peter hollands who does the acapella singing stuff um i finished working with them on the patreon so you're gonna see a push for patreon um one of the biggest problems i'm having right now is that i'm having to do two jobs and then try and do a lot of content creation and um two jobs is too much so i'm pushing the patreon to get rid of job number one and i mean job number two so i can have more time to do what i want to do and be able to actually collab with people because we get doodles like okay what's your schedule when can you do a stream if we're doing a stream day or whatever and it's like they give me a, a section of five days and every hour of each of those five days and it's like i can i'm only free for two of those hours <laughs> and it's just like my life is way too busy so my goal my number one goal is to start making enough money with content creation to at least get rid of the second job but it won't take a lot of money but um it will free up a ton of time for me to focus on what i want to do and the more focus i can do on this the better content i can give you guys so i'm looking forward to um doing that content creation is my goal i want to be known eventually as an influencer and be able to 
help people out with their lives emotionally with traumas that that has happened in the past to just giving people minecraft videos that they can just put on in the background and do homework or watch me stream or listen to some of my music and so forth so a lot of things are going to be changing my uh schedule is now going to be consistent because i have um for the last two months i've been kind of working out some sort of way i can do everything i want to do and i think i finally found the groove so the groove is going to go and i guess this video just hit 10 minutes long so i'm going to get out of here because god can die. do i have diarrhea of the mouth so butterflies don't forget to spread your wings and fly away have a great day i'll see you later uh one quick thing i'm probably going to be streaming on sunday so just keep your eyes open for that i'm not guaranteeing that i'm going to stream on sunday but some an events happening on sunday and i think i might be streaming it i may just record it for a video so i'm not 100 percent sure but you may see me streaming on monday and go check out the f1 video i just released earlier this morning and i will see you on monday with the mr craft video and if you're a patreon keep an eye out for the mr craft video on patreon saturday love you guys goodbye